let's have an interview with uh, Ash Sibyl, who has uh, worked in Tampere and Pallovekot since uh, this year's February as a youth and talent coach. Hi, Ash. Hi. So tell me about your time in, in TPV and Tampere so far. It's been great so far. Um, fantastic city. Uh, really enjoy like the environment and the working environment's great. Great pitches um, and the players have been fantastic to work with so far. Uh, yeah. Good to hear. What about the weather then? <laughs> Surprisingly great summer. I'd say it wasn't what I was expecting. Having been in Iceland, I thought it was going to be similar to Iceland and kind of not ever get warm. However, it was a nice summer and was able to enjoy the lake and the beaches and, and get on the water. So that was good. Okay, but the best time is yet to come. Yes, yeah, yeah. Sorry here. <laughs> so, and the good news from today is that uh, you have signed a new contract with the club and, and you will spend, uh, spend with us uh, two more years. Yeah, yeah, so I signed the contract yesterday and yeah, next two years I'll be, be with TPV. Okay, so what were the primary reasons for you to, to stay? We are, we are of course delighted about the news. Um, really enjoy kind of how it's been so far, but also the, the mission of the club and the project of the club over the next few years that, and, and how I think it, it can go forward. and. I'm looking forward to being a part of that and having, hopefully having an impact uh, on the players and the club over the next, the next few years. Okay, so tell me more about, uh, about your goals. So where do you see the youth development in Tampere and Pallovegot, let's say in two years? I think already it's in a great place. Um, you can see in the first team now, there's, it's, it's such a young squad. Um, again, that's kind of one of the reasons why I want to want to continue at the club because I think if you've got good young players, it's good to give them the opportunity and the platform at the best level they can. Um, and I can just see that continuing over the next couple of years. The more we can push players into that that men's environment, hopefully they can then make that next step. And we've already seen. Since I've been here, there's been players that were at TPV and have moved on in Finland, have now moved on to, to other places in Scotland, in Denmark. Um, so hopefully we can continue that and maybe push that on even further where it's directly a player going from TPV to a club abroad. So with Ash Sibyl, we will have a, all the better player part. Hopefully, with the young players. yeah, yeah, and that's 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 why I want to to kind of continue that that player pathway. I think has been there at the moment, but keep pushing the individuals on, um, as well as trying to create that that great team environment, that great team culture. But the individual players here, we've already got some that uh, in the younger age groups that are hopefully going to be exciting players that can move up in the next two three years. So. Yeah, continuing what's already here and maybe progressing it further. Sounds interesting. Uh, and there's one more question. It's the most important one. What is your favorite animal? <laughs> My favorite animal? That's a good question. Um, what? Probably I've shown a, a couple of different videos to, to the players, not football related. Um, and one of them's been with killer whales. So I'll probably say a killer whale. Um, getting them to think about what it is to, to work as part of a team um, and killer whales do that quite well. Okay, that sounds great. So thank you for the interview and uh, have a nice time in Tepe around Tampa. No problem, thank you. Thank you.